Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to solve an integral problem using the properties of the definite integral. So here we have a modeler and I am going to take this as three integrals. That is i1 equal to first part limit from 2 to 4 mod x minus 2 dx. Then i2 equal to integral 2 to 4 mod x minus 3 dx then i3 equal to integral 2 to 4 mod x minus 4 dx now coming to i1 i2 and i3 we are going to apply the property which is integral from a to b f of x dx is integral from a to c f of x dx plus integral from c to b f of x dx suppose if there is a limit from a to b this can be split into two parts by taking some value c in between a and b. Now coming to i1, we have mod x minus 2. So our limit is from 2 to 4 and before 2 mod x minus 2 is negative and after 2 it is positive. So from 2 to 4 it is only x minus 2. So if I split this i1 equal to from 2 to 4, we don't have any negative part, only it is positive part. So integral 2 to 4, x minus 2 dx. So we are going to integrate this, which is x square by 2 minus 2x and it is from 2 to 4. We will substitute the upper limit. When I put 4 square, when I put 4, it is 4 square, 16 by 2, which is 8 minus 4 to are 8. So I completed the upper limit. Now lower limit, 2 square is 4, 4 by 2 is 2 and again minus 4. So this is 0, this is minus 2 and outside there is a minus or plus 2. Totally i1 value is 2. In the same way, i2 is 2 to 4 and mod x minus 3. So we have a number line from 2 to 4. Since it is mod x minus 3, by equating this to 0, we get x minus 3 equal to 0, it means x is equal to 3. So somewhere 3 is here. So before that, this mod x minus 3 is negative and after 3, it is positive. So this will be split into 2 power from 2 to 3 minus of x minus 3 dx and from 3 to 4, it is plus x minus 3 dx. Now we have to do integral. So this will become x square by 2 minus 3x and we have to substitute the limit from 2 to 3 in the same way this is x square by 2 minus 3x and limit is from 3 to 4 so first we are going to substitute the upper limit here so minus 9 by 2 minus 9 then minus lower limit 2 square is 4 4 by 2 is 2 minus 6 plus 4 square 16 16 by 2 8 minus 12 minus 3 square 9 by 2 minus 9. Now minus of when I simplify this I get minus 9 by 2. When I simplify this it is minus 4 outside there is minus of plus 4. So first part is over and second part this is minus 4 and this part is minus 9 by 2 already there is a minus so plus 9 by 2. Now we will take this minus inside. So this will become 9 by 2 minus 4 and this is minus 4 plus 9 by 2. Totally 9 by 2 9 by 2 becomes 9 and minus 4 minus 4 is minus 8. Totally it is 1. Now coming to i3 it is mod x minus 4 limit is from 2 to 4. So we have 2 to 4 and mod x minus 4 if I equate to 0 we get x is equal to 4. So it is here. So after 4 it is positive but before 4 it is negative. So it is having the negative value. So 2 to 4 will become only minus of x minus 4 dx. When we integrate it is x square by 2 minus 4x and limit is from 2 to 4. So for the upper limit we get 4 square 16 16 by 2 8 minus 4 4 16. 
then coming to the lower limit 2 square by 2 which is 2 minus 8 again so totally this is minus 8 and this is minus 6 so it will become plus 6 and totally this is minus 2 outside that's a minus so it will become plus 2 now our i is made up of i1 plus i2 plus i3 so i1 we got 2 i2 is 1 and i3 is 2 so 2 plus 1 plus 2 totally it is 5 